Hi everybody, I'm Philip Duncan. Thanks for joining us for our Monday weather video brought to you by Country TV on Sky Channel 081. Well, we've had a windy weekend, very windy. Now we've got the change, the southwest change coming through. We've got a few showers in the mix caught up, as you can see out here on the western side. Drier skies on the eastern side, and in fact, we're heading into a warmer pattern once again uh, once we get through this current cooler weather. You can see the South Island, uh, this is what they call the wind map, but also the misery index. And that means we measure the temperature. So you see all the orange up here, that's warm stuff, green, temperate, blue, cold. So the blue southerly coming up and it's just affecting the shading of the South Island and even a little bit here in the central areas. It's a bit cooler is my point as we go through Monday, but there's a change coming. There's a high just there, already scooping up warmer air like that around it and moving towards us. So as we go through Tuesday, that high drifts closer so does the warmer airflow. So this is the Tuesday setup. Warmer west to northwest winds come back. Your highs around the eastern areas from Canterbury up towards Gisborne are in the mid 20s. Could be as high as 26 degrees for some of you. Uh, southern and western areas much cooler. Remember that blue bit we just showed you on the misery index? That's coming straight into Southland. So your Tuesday is cold. Highs struggling to get into the teens around Otago and uh, some parts of Southland. But once you get inland, away from the wind being so direct off the sea. It could be quite warm. Highs could get up around 20 degrees further inland amongst the mountains and hills there. Now to Wednesday, and here's the big theme, the big change coming. Of course, November 30th is the final day technically for spring, although many of you also believe in the solstice, which is sort of the global way of measuring the seasons. That's not another three weeks yet. So the summer solstice is still coming, but we are seeing a change with all this high pressure rolling in for the final day of spring and the first day of summer in New Zealand and Australia. Here it is, high pressure dominates the country and I can tell you it dominates for the first week. There's a bit of rain around, might get trapped here and there around the country, so it's not perfect, but the wind is easing, the temperatures are going back to normal and the first week of December does look pretty settled. Now if you want the 10 minute, 10 day forecast, you need to go to countrytv.co.nz or go to Sky Channel 081.